Brunilda. I'm Galen's mother. Uh, I'm called by Bernie usually, but I do prefer Brunilda. And um, I've been, I've had the pleasure of raising Galen. So I do hope that um, you find him as unusual and as uh, funny and comical as I do. It's time to do an event, and it's called Fashion Night Out. It's being held at the Village of Merrick Park, which is located in Coral Gables. It's for Dress for Success. Well, you know, going across that alligator alley. You want to go fast. <laughs> yeah. And I go the speed limit. I may go five miles over, but that's it. Can you believe borders closed in? Oh, it's still there. They're still they're still liquidating. Oh, wow. Maria Del Posto. You made it! Yay! Yeah, thank, thank you. you. Mm -hmm. You're going to love this you. event. It's fabulous. <laughs> um, Sonia, this is Daniela. Hi, Hi Daniela. Sonia. Nice, nice to, to meet, meet you. you. How are you? So. Sonia! Hi! <laughs> Mommy's here! How are you? <laughs> An amazing amount of people watching there. This is Galen, our board president. This Hi. is Sandy, yes. one of our oh, volunteers. Yes. This is oh my God, it kills me. I'm telling you, I think I'm gonna die. This you. Mom. Hi. Hi. This is Sandy. Nice this is Erwin. Erwin, hi. Nice Hi. to meet you. How Same are here. you? Hey there. Nice, nice to meet you, Galen. How are you? Now, what can I do for you? Well, we've got our setup here. There's two more upstairs. Okay, so why don't you? People are just starting to come. Why don't you just walk around and shop and browse and look, okay. have a drink, and then when I need you, we're probably going to have to cover both tables upstairs. The same set of this. Here's what we're doing. Oh yeah, we got to be handing these out. Here are the pals. Yeah, this is what I And I happen to be planning an event there for Diane Cannon. Uh, for Dress for Success. <laughs> yeah. So we need to hand these out. Oh, okay. Do you want to help me hand these out? Yeah, that's right. Oh, I didn't know she'd moved right now. She learned new things every day. I'm hungry. So we're raising some money. Six dollars. That's so sweet. Thank you so much. We're looking at some fashion. There's lots of food. I've taken a step and I've hired a personal trainer. Guava and cheese, strawberry, red velvet, and vanilla rum. Lots of cocktails. Like an organic vodka that was to die for. Yes, and I also got to see my friend Marisol Patton, who's a real housewife of Miami. I, well, you know what? I saw you going down the hall, the corridor, and I knew that I wasn't going to get you. Oh, I'm to go to each lounge as yeah. much as I can. And it really turned out it's such a beautiful event. Anyway, she owns the Patton Group, which is working with us, and they've put on the event and included Dress for Success as their uh, charity of choice. So we're very happy. I have to go out to Miami International Airport because they're introducing a new people mover system that will take people, it'll shuttle people, from the terminal upon arrival to the new ultra-modern rental car uh, so area. We the film this, this is beautiful. I got to look in here yesterday. It's awesome. So we get to go, we can go ride that at any time and go over right, the... Right, the train's running. I believe it's already running. Yes. Okay. Right. So, uh, All right. I'm excited. This is the new, the new oh, cool. Metro mover. And this is a big deal for Miami because it's been a mess for a long time. And they've been going through an airport improvement that's taken 25 years. So I have to cover this because, after all, I am the sky steward and I have to talk about things that can travel better.
So, uh, I mean, I loved the, ter the people mover system. It was fantastic, but you know how these events can get. <laughs> It was, um, there were all these people that I didn't even know. And grabbed some free food, which I love, free food. And chit-chatted, watched the color guard. Left, right, left. Left, right, left. Uh, and then it was time to sneak out. They probably turn the train on so we can't leave. <laughs> the train is still running, right? Yeah, it's looking. Okay. That was funny. <laughs> so we snuck out, and luckily they kept the train running because it wasn't really open to the public yet. They kept the train running so we could hop on a train back to the terminal. <laughs> 